Welcome to Freetown, the capital city of Sierra Leone. Freetown hosts the government of Sierra Leone. Freetown is a vibrant city, day and night. Most people mistakenly treat Sierra Leone as if Freetown is the whole of Sierra Leone. But actually, Sierra Leone is made up of four regions, North, East, Southern provinces and the Western area. Freetown is situated in the Western area. This documentary is based in Freetown. However, if things are so bad in Freetown, it's almost pointless to go to other parts of the country because the story is being told in Freetown. People will say because of wrong mindset. The way people and they think, and the life where they live now, not that it's not good for a person depend on person, but you your mind for focus and know what you want. And like if we think about that rebel war waiting go on, some things that they happen now, I don't think to say it's supposed for they happen. Disorder. The disorder is plenty. Too much of disorder. Because if you mindset stay focused, you go think right. And, and and most of the terrorists make us say that the, the situation not solve. Three fourths of people just say government, 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 government. And, and you the individual now you know the government. Now you go make yourself be what you suppose for be. If one thing or one right, you can make a right with your own correct mindset. But some man not still understand. Me personally, I can take and promise if I did pass in within around. If I see person to go with the as kid, I tell you pick up. And at times, in day, you're not that easy. If you not take care, you go and get confrontation. But I can stand my ground for saying say it is wrong. You know, right? Change your mindset. Not to go with the as kid. Because not to nobody go make your environment clean. That's not the one big disorder if you really. You find out the dirty box being there. But Uda, if one genuinely, genuinely not the same disorder where they tell you but then dirty box then they if back like a weary and I will be get one. Then then put the dirty box they build for sell for, for the sell market. Now markets then they put in as put them small small boot. Who side the dirty box for the encourage we all let we change your attitude? Let we change your attitude because if you mind renew your attitude will set we mindset wrong we know they think right we depend on waiting we go get not to wait till we go give ourselves we go make we get what will make us change is just dedication to the core if i may say changing of attitude you know and uh, changing of concepts you know, you study what you make, but where will they come up? I will win it. Because I believe for study, I always feel say I for succeed in life any kind of way. So we come to a point where we secondary school. We get this because we can't do it with Your mind is more sister I became. And because of that, he say me and said that support you with lunch. But guess what? We need to work all the way from Campbell Street for go for we we'll take lunch in the morning before we school. And maybe we go all the way to Tawai. So we get this supermarket, we need to the supermarket, mini market will be in here, we need to Campbell Street, Congo Market Junction. They be called a super fresh, they send them, they sell them fresh produce, they sell milk, or they measure by all. So I can buy this milk, go to school for my own purpose. Then you can see me back there, I'm a test me now, I'm a test me now. So I'm going to cut it. I say, this milk here, always at the big one. Before time, before I leave, we don't know. I say, okay. Now I can do business. I buy 5,000, I can't. I use the baby milk spoon. <laughs> they sell like 500 for spoon. Before the milk, they do around 10,000. I get 5,000 in top. So I'm not being need for the work. I go to me and take again for go take transport and come. They can call me I'm a plan B because I always get a plan B to anything what they do. So I sit, go on, go on, I sit, was, but I'm not getting requirements. Unfortunately for me, I get pregnant. I say I get belly now. Ah, this is school don't do. We did talk come. I only make, make look I don't go get belly. I go, I sit private to us, so me, nobody know. I get my requirements with the same belly at college. Nobody know belly. Okay, I'm not supposed to rely on government. 
in most places in most developed countries you can see a graduate a master degree holder he's on his own doing his own thing until he develops the very concept of his you know students i name john cc i don't see two hours one day then after that i don't get work for it i decide for this work at least that it gets me really great for the school you are the struggle and they go school as it was obviously i'm not going to plan i start with the business one day those are the things that I want to start to happen in our land, Sierra Leone, in our country, Sierra Leone. Do you understand? People should change the way, the, the kind of mentality to convert their mentality into productivity. So where I register, um, a woman in stops, I sell letter of personal money stops, letter of partnership and collaboration. They agree and so okay. When people start realizing that kind of idea, having that kind of ideas, then you see things start changing on its own. Like one should know without government you can make things happen on your own. Do you understand me? So those are the concepts that I need people to start having. The idea of changing into creativity, self creativity, not waiting for salary. There's a lot of things that one can do in this country without, without government and you will awesomely excel. Coming to Sierra Leone, I set out to explore the mindset of Sierra Leoneans, especially Freetown. After my first day of going around town, talking to people from different walks of life, I realized that mindset is not the issue. You know, people complain that Sierra Leoneans are bad. You know, Sierra Leoneans are opportunistic. You know, um, you know, people don't really say good things about Sierra Leoneans. And this is even Sierra Leoneans among themselves, you know, um, one Sierra Leoneans to another saying, you know, all these negative things about each other. And um, so I was so curious to explore this and see if it's, you know, what it is that they're saying. Um, going around Freetown, talking to people and seeing, you know, poverty in the city this is the capital city of Sierra Leone Freetown not far from where officials people who are tasked with you know looking after us Sierra Leoneans not so far from where they work and live you know going around you see such abject poverty I got to realize that these people are rather victims. You know, these accusations, you know, yes, you can see the traits of what people say. People try to get anything they can out of you. You know, going around town, you've got to hold your bag, you know, you've got to watch your phone, you know, taking transports, you get overcharged. It's there. But these people are victims. Who put my daddy for let work? So let bring job for we. That will go happy for her. And do other things there where necessary. And that we wish for we wish for. So how life day for you? Right now it's and you know and not too proper. But to take out thank you, life day and well body day. But we need for do more. What you guys girl they do? Okay. So we say your soul. Correct me if I wrong. So it means say you they sleep with man there for money? Yes. How much are you old? You know 18 years. You know 18 years old? Yes. Then you they sleep with man there for money? Yes. Why do they do that? Because the, the, the country, the way the country, I mean, most of we were put on common I forgot Qatar. I forgot Qatar for go work. Okay, why do they go Qatar for go work? Uh, because. You see this country now, in Mona. They mean a family man. I get me picking. 
I get some of my brother and sisters they want to take care of. And I don't go there. I get a things for take care of them. Pastor go out and do job and get a small thing for take care of them. So you know they hear about how they save them, they teach people in Libya and Saudi Arabia and all them places. Yeah, there. yeah, Ariari, Ariari, Bim Bim say then who they see, who they watch them, they teach them. Actually, at the country we mona, I may call them here they be. Man they come out, go friend living out, you know, they, they teach with salon brothers and sisters them because of the country mona. You know go there so get work, you work and feed you, you your family pass unless you go out. And when you go out now you go you go face the thing and day, you know. Think about it. Over three decades of mismanagement, neglect. You can only live your life the way you know how to live it. Some people have grown from childhood to adulthood. Not seen any positivity in their lives. So we all want to go to one from nobody knows you one politician. Why? So my kid can say too much sin the end. When you enter inside politics, your life they change. Let me say things that we not really do. <laughs> you get for begin to do that. Because then say politics not a game. Okay. You get for lie, you get for begin lie, you get for begin cook. Okay. And things that we be say you for do for the community or the country, you will do one, but it's not good enough. Because, for example, if you're not a leader in the community, like say, you know, councillor, sometimes the government don't give money, say, this money I give you now for social reason and for provide social things in the community. And instead of you do waiting and give you the money for, you know, go do all, you go all that money there and use them for your family use. And you know, go do one. For the community. Instead of that, you go all answer yourself. Politics, if you join politics, you will become a sinner. You will become a sinner. Very sinner. <laughs> <laughs> if uh, government give me work, I will do the money, give me the money, I see what it's for help me people. Okay. I help them. Do you have people say politics and I will? No, we are politicians to politics. Okay. They are, they are liars. <laughs> yeah, but, but you love the people then. Yes, I don't want life on me. Alright, see, okay. I don't want life on me. I don't want life on me. Say, tomorrow I will really preach for you at this school. Yeah. Then next tomorrow, yeah, because of me, I don't lose yes. the power, I'm not able to do it. Then, yeah, but at least now because you lose the power. Yeah, you know, power they shame. So, me, I would, I would tell God thank you for us because I know I'm for being a politician. Why? Yes. The sinful things they would do in plenty. No, I'm not going to tell you at all. Okay, so I'm just saying. Okay, 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 okay. Like, for example, some minister go Canada and say, when I write to name them all, when I give me a name them, I get a job for una all. Trust me, when I go follow that minister, they say, they be able to say that job, they pass God help to make in Guna. Like they honorable and so they cancel all and so and then are the people and then the way they go and grab people and land them because of in a honorable in a counselor they go grab the land with in name and in power then they're not good now god inside the politician first of all they not get shape and two mm. what's in it mean they put in our politics lie not only because of now and because I have kept certain guidance that they have for and they use. And they would tell me, they say, let me talk something, you, it's supposed to be free. If you don't feel free, they will get open to the great of that law. But I just think that's why I'm not getting open. Yeah, but if you lost, if you lost, then all man lost and I lost, you lost. That's not you, man. Yes. But if you win, mm -hmm. if you didn't have the power there, Anyway, well, no, 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 no
the new angle politics who for you so who for you do you want so no, yes. because that the that the new person about me una na na the inside the community no okay so okay is that the left of the community yes the community okay because now because i think i got one question politics they want only somebody go in politics that you know if they the community without politics because some of the things that one are talk right now yeah. you need for the is inside the politics yeah, yeah. Yeah, it seems like because yeah, it's like some of the things they want to talk, I think they will now fundamental problems they now. Yeah, but why the politician them ever since government, no government, no government, no government, they're not able to help the people there. That is strong community. So now my time for people in that community to take charge. Politics they change policy entirely. It make you become more than ever become. Because ever we as you enter inside politics, it begin lie. You need righteous. You need to do things according to, because like, for example, if me na, <laughs> if me na, I don't stand na area, for me or any other thing, I they make the people they go down for me. I they promise them as soon as I vote for me, when I vote for me, they build for our schools, health facilities, water well, pump, and any other thing. I they promise them, but what good thing? They are even promise to say I go make some of our people that will go school free without no and without they not give school fee. I they talk to the fine, they, they support me. And for long we no more. And they max themselves. We see that they put themselves, they, they talk to you. Politics is impossible to become a liar. They, they talk to you. They say vote for me. We see vote for them. We see they don't win. Whether they pass, they, they wind the glass up. For many not see yourself. Then they're not fine. They make you go be you they be good enough for be. If you feel if you not be a good person, they change totally. Yes. Yes, sir. So they are now a problem with them. Exactly, exactly, exactly. So they may suffer some problem. Mm -hmm. We need help. Mm -hmm. So if say you decide now for go inside politics, local politics, mm -hmm. for help solve that problem, I not see who's, for me in my opinion, I not see who's time on the or who's time by If you don't get resources, hmm? if you don't get the resources, politics spend your money, you always. You see the politics we need to talk about so the whole other politics. Whole other politics. People they look to you effortly they do that community. Yeah, they correct you. Then they case you up for saying you some side. Say that you will represent we. You will bring development. Yeah. We on politics. Now now as I see not so I call me two three people in the community. I say I want to stand for council or like a member of parliament. The first thing when I go to hear ask me. Uh, uh, we don't talk to start a minute. Rest of what's up? Tip for itself, no day. I think it was. I think it was. The way the people in the camp and they can't listen to you, you go for things, say, hey, the youth man and the heavy lock this. Yes. They all mean that the heavy lock this. Well, as you can see that the heavy lock is, the youth man they go to the corner, they go to the heavy lock, they watch and so they say that 20, 30,000 a day. They say, but what I can't do is, let me know that I can't talk to them, talk to them for 30,000 years. Which are the cowboys in China, now we go. Then they look to your efforts, who you try to bring them with. Then the man that way they come, they can bring them two, three hundred million, which means they can't spend, they can't be a member of parliament, they can't spend 50, 60 million years. So, if you don't understand how to say, your resources is special for me to get the power. Where is your power? What is it for you? For let drive on, for let make the money, not so. So before people don't get the money, you don't want to make benefit for things for other people. So 25 years gone down. They don't know. <laughs> so this is a big problem in Africa, especially Sierra Leone. I understand, I understand, on that. Maybe I need to talk like what? So we're in a community now. Like we're in a we're the community. We know everybody. We're the community. If we don't say serve this man, we we want him, we want him, but he no get money. We cannot go serve in a party for girls. We know the girl. Yeah. Because yeah. Money. Then yeah. you don't have money, then 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 you don't have money, this man can talk time for the country. Yes. Yes. We can look at and say, all men are vex. Nobody knows they give you one time. But the people elect the party where he belongs to. But these aspirant people don't want to again. Then the people in the one way they want, you know, can get money. 
We don't move with our spirits, they we care and go to the party. So far. Uh, we bring this party, we see them look the guy, they look the guy, they ask the guy, they, the woman pull all the way to them calling. You see, we don't show everything. The guy say the man, we land past the park, we have to We land past her, we have yeah. education. Yeah. And they don't see all the projects that we don't write in the community. We, we don't develop the community. As I tell you so, then they need to do that. That's what they write all the projects they did. Then come to the way in the job of Susan's way. He didn't say this official as an organization. That's what they did. And they do a lot. Even that small education center where we get there, that small school where we get there, in hands there. Now they go what about the way right? We go all out where we get health center. We don't get money. Now education we get. So it's so painful. It's really painful to see how people who can afford, even people who have been really poor before, but have been able to step up. It's really painful to see people who live outside Sierra Leone talk about Sierra Leoneans without empathy, not standing from where the Sierra Leonean is standing, just seeing things from where they are standing. It's so painful. And at this stage, I would like to apologize to Sierra Leoneans, for all of us, for all of us who accuse the Sierra Leonean as a bad person, for all of us who accuse the Sierra Leonean for being a victim in other places. When you're a victim, you've been looked after, you've been cared for. But Sierra Leoneans are not cared for. They're not being looked after as victims. If we will understand the problem in our salon, we will maybe we will be solving the problem because I mean we get young people as well as elderly people there, but life not done it until we die. Like with me on so I don't know game of me. I live at the area. So yes. But just because of I meet many people and manage life, there is no option. The person I'm going to take the challenge and leave the end. So for me, not get a job to allow you to support them for move from the slum for we live another better life than. Well right now, me are the brain now, let's do try clean. We do clean just now. This is the good family living like in Jimmy. You know that they do business. I know where my kids are going. We will go to the hotel, they have past 11, we will go to the Thank you, we will go to the bank, we will pay to 2,000 or 3,000. Commission. That if you get sent, I will pay for it. We will get sent, we will get 3,000. We will pay the one who will pay for it. And that's 3,000. Then school don't come up with that. We will pay for it. We will pay for it. Like a rent house. We will get nobody with the AP. A piece of woman they don't die. On a true that day, in the we get power, we pay with strength, we pay with light bill, we pay with we get a school fee, we get a lunch, we buy books there. But still, we tell God thank you, we appreciate because I didn't call one three four. And also we address you. That's of our push a different. Money no the not in only. No see the itself. But we are doing the work for you. I don't know. You cannot leave it. Yeah. So as I report to us, I did beg you that side of it. We are like, we did so far that we did not stay with you, my dear. We can normally be saying the woman name, um, they can so far pass the man name. Then I can now have a lunch, I'll get one spot, and then I can get one spot. And then I can go to the other spots, to the lunch. So we tell you carry me a worker from police school. So, 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 so,
So you still have a big car, so you can continue with that. You give me out for me. Because I have a lot of people in the world. So I said, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. For me, I'm going to do it. Subjects, almost teacher to teach one subject. One, one. one teacher to teach all <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> 
All my neighbors ask questions inside the class. So we teach if we ask you understand. Don't tell teacher get the patient set. Oh, you pass the test. You understand? You understand? Pass who don't have it. Yes. So my love you understand. No, you think you mistake. You not come by. Ninety people on here. We are present. We are present. We are present. We will stay for the end of the day when I talk to you because if we are on our night in the inside class or on our own day, then the decks are not going off. Sometimes one of the decks now four or five days. We sometimes have to stay comfortable with you. Who decks are outside? Long, long decks. Five years. Long decks. 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 One class. Because we're not going to get exams. Yeah, it's empty. It's empty. So they're done. So then they allow them to cancel. Obviously, we're not going to cancel. We all believe in change. And we all believe change is possible. We also believe change takes time. But the reality, the future in Sierra Leone, with the current trend of things, seem to be gloomy. Going around, talking to people and analyzing the information that we're getting and the things we've seen Sierra Leonean seems to be like an individual hanging on a rope over a bridge gasping for air and fighting for their survival I agree though that people have to push themselves but I will argue for the Sierra Leonean I don't think we Sierra Leonean, we are lazy. I don't think we are bad. As a matter of fact, I think we are pushful because living in Sierra Leone is a miracle. I don't even understand how people live in this country. People wake up in the morning, rush to town to sell their goods. People go to work. But the truth is, we need sound government. We need governments to create systems. We need governments to spearhead solutions. Going around Freetown talking to people, I made some observations. There is lack of jobs. The people really are crying for jobs and opportunities. It seems as if there is no creativity. There is shortages of houses. People live in shacks, shanty houses. Freetown is a small place. So these shanty houses that people live in, they just less than an hour drive from where you know the seat of government is, where um, NGOs, where everybody work. The transportation system is so bad, it's so poor. There is no there is no organized form of transport. It's all individuals. And it's so unreliable. So much traffic. People are less concerned about their safety. The roads are so bad. Dusty. There is a massive disorganization around town. It seems as if there is no regulations or laws. Everybody just does what they want. People are scared to talk to us. We've got to let them know we're not from the government. Even at that, they still struggle to open up because they're still not sure if we're telling the truth. The education system is poor. The educational facilities are not there. Spoke to people and they're talking about the curriculum at school is obsolete. 
there is lack of adult education. When you speak to people, you get to realize these people find it hard to think for themselves, find it hard to form a concrete opinion. People do not trust the politicians. In fact, people think it's sinful to be in politics. People think you, as soon as you become a politician, you become co-opted straight away. Politics are too They are liars. <laughs> yeah, but, but you love your people then. Yes, yeah, so I know I like Pandem. Oh, I see. Okay. I know I like Pandem. <laughs> I know I like Pandem. Say, tomorrow I'll go build a bridge for you, I'll build a school. People don't trust politicians at all. Governments seem to be far from the people. There is the death of the popular culture. You go around, there's not many things that you can see which keep people together. There's death of lifestyle. There has been a loss in community spirit. Every man for themselves. This is what people say. There's a lot of things we can't put on camera because it compromises the dignity of people. There's so much low self-esteem, lack of confidence. People neglect their environment, even themselves. I said Sierra Leoneans are victims because this nation is endowed with so many natural resources and a young, vibrant population. But yet they're experiencing deprivation through mismanagement of their wealth. If Sierra Leone is to change, we all have to accept that every Sierra Leonean is a victim. To solve this problem, we have to realize, alongside political and economic solution, there is a psychological approach to solving the problems in Sierra Leone. In fact, a strong emphasis should be laid on psychological approach. Victims should be treated in a scientific and well thought program, as it is usually done in countries referred to as developed countries. Everyone seems to have forgotten that after abuse and victimization, it brings about change in one's attitude and behavior. It seems as if everyone has forgotten that the traumas the alien have encountered, their mindset is bound to be affected negatively. It also seems as if everyone has forgotten that Sierra Leone has gone through a nasty civil war. Over three decades of economic and political mismanagement. With the level of poverty in Sierra Leone for decades, generally, survival becomes the norm. Fighting for survival means that nothing is important to you than surviving. Therefore, we see opportunistic behavior to the highest degree, such as stealing, duping, begging, and cheating taking place. Deliberate action should be taken to shape the mindset of people which will change their behavior. If I should suggest some solutions, I would say let's remember the reason for the civil war in Sierra Leone, but also commemorate the civil war as it has shaped the future of our country. We do commemorate the world wars, but we blank out a war which have shaped our country. I would say stop importing solutions from abroad to solve Sierra Leone's problem. Ask the Sierra Leonean people how to solve their own problem and act on the suggestions they make. We have our unique problems. Our culture is different to other places and other people. There should be a massive job creation program such as building factories nationally, but preferably away from Freetown to decentralize and reduce the population of Freetown. There should be massive building of homes for people due to the gap in education and the trauma that 
Sierra Leoneans have been through. A practical mind shaping and national program should be designed for the whole nation, including politicians and our leaders. In fact, they should be in the forefront of enrolling in the program. We should also start working on the future generation by changing the old curriculum at school, including a patriotic and mind shaping elements in the curriculum. We should make the punishment of corruption in public office as equal as murder because actually stealing the money of the people is actually killing the future generation. Hence we see Sierra Leone today. Make possession of large amounts of money illegal. We should use the banking system. We should also make unofficial visits at work illegal, especially in public offices. To solve the problem of Sierra Leone, there must be urgency. There must be drastic short-term immediate solution alongside medium and long-term plans. At this stage, there must be a complete change in culture. Sierra Leone is almost the only place in the world where we want change, but we do not want to change our culture. I'll end by referring to Maslow's hierarchy of needs until the physiological needs, the basic needs of Sierra Leoneans of food, water, clothing and shelter until they are met, Sierra Leoneans would not achieve their dreams. Sierra Leoneans would not benefit out of the potential of their country, of our country.